the rice moth rearing boxes which have been used for 100 days are being cleaned for reuse then the remnant in the used boxes is disposed of The clean boxes are being treated in hot air oven at 100 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes to kill the pathogens and eggs of different store grain pastes. Maize grains are taken in metal trays. The trays are placed in hot air oven at 100 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes to kill different store grain paste present in it.
groundnut kernels are taken in metal trays and the trays are placed in hot air oven at 100 degrees celsius for 30 minutes The roasted kernels are ground in grinder. Dry smooth rearing boxes are being prepared. In each box, 2.5 kg of crushed maize grain and 100 g of roasted groundnut kernel is added. During treatment in hot air oven, the maize grain and groundnut kernel lose moisture. Hence, to increase the moisture content at 14 to 16 percent, 30 to 50 ml water is sprinkled. The contents of the box are thoroughly mixed by both the hands. Two gram of streptomycin sulfate is added in the box as antibiotic. Five gram of yeast powder is added as food supplement to increase the size and egg-laying capacity of the rice mops. These are thoroughly mixed with crushed maize grain and the surface is leveled. Zero point five CC of fresh egg of rice moth is sprayed over the green surface as nearly as possible 
and the lid is closed. boxes are arranged in the rigs and the date of preparation is written on the boxes with chalk. Eggs hatch in 3 to 4 days, larva feed for 30 to 40 days and then pupate for 7 to 10 days. Adult emergence starts from 40th to 54th day. The moths are collected manually from the boxes with specimen tubes. The moths are released in the oviposition cages. Some moths escape and seat on the walls and ceiling of the rearing room. These moths are collected by mechanical device fitted with vacuum cleaner directly into the oviposition case. are collected in a tray placed below the oviposition keys. Eggs are contaminated with scales and other broken body parts like legs, mouth parts, antenna and wings. Scales are eliminated by blowing air by mouth along the direction of wind in an open place. Other broken body parts are discarded by sieving through a tree strainer and winnowing on a piece of art paper. are measured in cc and put in glass or plastic vials. 
the mouth of the valves are closed with cotton balls Eggs are stored in the refrigerator at 5 to 10 degrees Celsius for one month. The inoculum caps are taken out of the refrigerator and are placed singly in polythene bags along with air. The mouth of the bag is tied with rubber band. These bags are arranged on the laboratory table for added emergence. The rice moth eggs are treated with 30 watt UV light for one hour to kill the embryos. The eggs are strained through tea strainer to break the lumps. The eggs are winnowed to eliminate broken body parts. Gum is smeared in thin layer on new inoculum card and 0.5 cc of rice moth eggs are spread over it uniformly.
gum is smeared in thin layer on tricocard and 1 cc of rice moth eggs are spread over it uniformly The newly prepared inoculum cards and traco cards are dried inside the laboratory under sealing fan. The trichogramma adults start emerging from the old inoculum card inside the polythene bag in 2 days. The bag is opened and one new inoculum card and two new traco cards are inserted into the bag. The mouth of the bag is again closed with rubber band after filling air in it. The bags are arranged in laboratory table. Trichogramma adult female lays eggs inside the rice moth eggs. Trichogramma eggs hatch in one day and the larvae feed on rice moth eggs for 4 to 5 days and then pupate. On pupation, trichogramma larvae and rice moth eggs turn black and the cards are ready. The bags are opened, the cards are taken out. date and species of trichogramma are written on trico cards and new inoculum cards The old inoculum cards are discarded. The trico cards and new inoculum cards are packed separately in polythene bags. These bags are kept in plastic boxes and stored in refrigerator at 5 to 10 degrees centigrade. The cards can be stored in refrigerator for a maximum period of 4 weeks. 
Within this period, the inoculum cards are used for rearing and the trico cards are applied in the field. During rainy season, a disposable plastic glass is placed in inverted position over a piece of trico card to prevent rain water falling on it. A piece of trico card may be inserted into the split on the top end of a bamboo stick installed in the field. may be stapled on the underside of the leaves. Trichogramma adult females emerged from the trichocards, search the eggs of the insect pastes and lay eggs inside the eggs of the pastes. Six application are required depending on the crops and the insect pastes. Trichogramma Egg parasitoids are used to control mainly the borer and the leaf-eating insect pastes of order Lepidoptera.